What's going on guys? Welcome back to Welcome back to another video. And in today's video, um, we're just gonna have some fun with the M3 and check out a car for my mom because she might be joining the BMW game. I think we need a cold startup on this 2016 F80 M3. It's crazy that this car sounds this good with the stock exhaust. Like, oh my god, I love this car. And this is Nora again with a small little interruption and that's because I need to give you guys a proper shout out. So all these guys right over here, the people that purchased it from day one till just recently, I just want to give a huge special shout out. We finally completed an entire page. I'm going to have to actually put another column because you guys are absolutely killing it with the merch drop. Yeah, so thank you to everyone over here for constantly helping the channel. Like I told you guys, I had to take pretty much a loan out to get this car and it's not a big loan, it's a little loan, but you guys are really helping me just get through that so we can get straight into the mod. And I just can't say enough how thankful I am that you guys are actually enjoying this build as much as I am. I was thinking about getting another rebuild on the channel, but this build, I was just like, it's an Atlantis blue F80. Like, when am I going to get another opportunity to cop this car? And uh, I was like, I, I just have to get it before he sells it to someone else. So today, I'm pretty much just going to be taking you guys on a journey with me. So we got a lot of little errands to do, a couple fun things. And one of them is we're getting a uh, camera bag because we're going on a trip to the Keys Motorsports show, literally across the United States. I'm going to be heading over there, going to be meeting a lot of you guys over there. So for those of you guys who are making it out there, uh, make sure to make it out there because I mean, I'll be there. I'll be there with Justin Weiss and I believe, I believe Think of 30 and a couple other guys. And obviously Brian from Keys Motorsports because it's his event, but I am super, super, super excited for that. But yeah, I need a camera bag. I need to get my drone there. I need to get my cameras, my GoPros, a bunch of stuff. Cause I mean, I, I, I want to make a really fun video out there and it should be a really fun travel vlog. So yeah, let's head down to Best Buy and just get our camera bag real quick. officially secured let's head on to our second journey which is um we need gas <laughs> first time gas filling up the f80 but um yeah shout out to nick for actually filling it up the first oh, hold up look at that carbon sheesh but yeah shout out to nick for giving us the full tank uh we need a second tank right now gas looking mighty fine um i did want to go ahead and do something when you guys ordered a package you guys were local so i was like you know what let me just go ahead and hand deliver that for that for that like five hour service because you ordered like five hours ago i was like you know what let me try to beat ups beat fedex <laughs> let me just hand deliver it so let's go ahead drop off this package you went ahead and ordered i believe the f80 air fresheners and you also got the f80 keychain so actually i think you got two of these too so shout out to my guy let's go ahead and deliver his package Hey guys, it looks like we beat UPS right there. <laughs> We've got that six hour delivery time. Oh, we gotta run. <laughs> guys, like tell me what service gets you guys a stuff in less than five hours. I mean, honestly, I'm just curious. But any easels, the next stop is Copart. So my mom has been looking at some X5s you guys been wanting to see an X5 series on the channel. I was just like, you know, we have a truck, but my mom wants one recently. She doesn't know if she really wants one or not. So we're just gonna go ahead and check it out, see if it's a good spec, see if everything is as it should be before we actually bid on it. And if everything's great in the Navy, uh, we might send it. So without further ado, I see you guys at the co-part. Um, three, two, one.
Just checked into Copart. Uh, I do need to get another vest because I completely forgot my vest at home. You guys need a vest to go into the yard itself. So man, have to blow another $5. It is what it is. So yeah guys, we just left Copart. You guys saw the footage of the X5. It's actually absolutely perfect. I literally saw some very minor things here and there. I mean, yeah, it does need repairs, but it doesn't look like I need to take it to the shop. And it looks like it runs and drives. Like, I don't see any issues to why it wouldn't run and drive. It started up just fine. There was no check engine light, no lights on the dash. Um, the only lights, there was a bunch of light bulb lights, but that's that makes sense because everything's unplugged. But um, other than that, I don't know guys, it might be something my mom wants, which would be pretty dope. And we are officially home with the new bag, guys. So I'm super excited. I'm gonna be meeting some of you guys at the Keys Auto Show. And yes, I need to get it back to put all the camera stuff inside of it, all my camera gear, you know, just to film a, diff a bunch of different angles and just have all my stuff safe. Because obviously if I'm going to the other side of the United States, I don't wanna throw all my cameras and all my heavy equipment and expensive equipment into a luggage bag and it gets destroyed. So if you guys look at it, it's actually really neat. So there's a small pocket here. There's a big pocket over here for like a tablet, maybe a small, uh, you know, MacBook Air or something, a bunch of other little pockets. But the main thing is, is this right here. This looks so good. So obviously I can put my DSLR, my camera. I can even take this off because I have the longer lens. Put my other lens equipment over here and uh, maybe even just even my laptop charger, something over here. So just to show you guys the before, this is all my camera coming from my GoPro to my vlogging camera to my actual photography camera. And then actually I have my DJI drone over there, but it's actually not gonna fit in here So we'll have that like a separate thing It still has its own kind of carry-on bag, which is fine But yeah, all this stuff including the lenses and everything all the little caps chargers um, You know polarizers mounts. I'm gonna try to fit everything in this bag and I think we have more than enough room for that So uh, yeah, three two one and just like that, guys, it looks so much better. So I got my GoPro with this mount, a couple other little mounting things for that, little shelves for it, all my chargers and charging cables in there. I got the pull, actually, I got the polarizer, but I got a couple of things for the lens over here. I got the polarizer right here, got the G7X right there, a couple batteries. I kind of want to just buy a whole bunch of batteries just so I can fill this up. <laughs> but anyway, that's that. I got all the GoPro mounts and everything in here, including my SD card um, carrier. So yeah, in terms of everything over here, everything is where it needs to be. I I still have a lot of room for other things I want to bring on the trips. So I can literally just put it in these two pouches and I can literally just take this bag. So I'm pretty happy about that. And what's also super nice is that actually this bag has something where you can actually put your uh, tripod. You can put it in here and then strap it so it actually holds your tripod and you don't have to have anything on your hand, which is again, pretty awesome. Well, what's up guys, this is the next day and uh, pretty much just showing you guys a day in the life, kind of just showing you guys pretty much a vlog of my life in this video, showing you guys a bunch of little things. We do need to take the F80 out for our first car wash. We did its first gas fill up, but we need also need the first car wash in this video. Me and my wife have been working on all of these orders. It literally took us probably somewhere in the ballpark of, I mean, I'd have to say 20 to like 25 hours. Me and my wife just working on this all night. So thank you all for the constant support on the channel. This is definitely gonna be helping out with the F80 bill. Thank you guys so much for supporting it. The F80, pretty much all the F80 merchandise is almost sold out. You guys are absolutely killing it. A lot of you guys ordered it in bundles where you get the F80 keychain and the F80 air fresheners, which looks 
super, super, super cool to get in a package like this. And some of you guys even ordered the i8 keychain with the i8 air fresheners. I think this keychain looks absolutely insane. So does this one. The keychain just looks so cool. Not to mention this packaging. Sheesh. <laughs> so yeah, again, guys, thank y'all so much for the support. If you guys want to cop the new merchandise, be shout out in the next video. Make sure to check it out down below. But without further ado, let me want to get all this stuff to the post office, pay all the fees because this is going to be costing a lot in shipping. And then head over and get the F80, its first car wash. Off to the post office, guys. Ah, oh, buddy, this car is perfect. <laughs> end of the video guys so if you guys enjoyed this video it's kind of like a vlog kind of thing bringing you guys on the journey of pretty much just enjoying life a little bit haven't had a video like that in a minute now honestly i've always just pretty much just you know worked on my cars or did something there or did something here and ended the video and uh, you know i mean it works but it's not as entertaining i feel like when i bring you guys on a journey and we're just doing a couple things you know like detailing the car getting its first gas fill up you know chopping off some packages copping some new equipment i feel like that stuff is kind of fun at the same time enjoying the f80 at the same time if you guys enjoy videos like this kind of some kind of like you know vloggish videos make sure to smash the like button i do like to do more of those but yeah guys i'm just waiting for new mods for the f80 i am just so 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 excited to actually modify this thing even more and more i don't know if you guys know but this thing doesn't even have a backup camera no apple carplay apple carplay obviously does not come on these kind of models but no backup camera like really so we're definitely gonna have to do a backup camera retrofit we're definitely gonna have to do apple carplay and like i said in the last video heads up display the dashboard and then uh what else we gotta do a bunch of carbon fiber we just need a bunch of carbon fiber so i'm already doing my research keys motorsports is sold out and a lot of the pieces that i want right now so i'm just kind of waiting for them to restock and we'll go ahead and place on all the orders that we need but yeah guys i'm actually curious is this the color if you guys have to choose an individual color for your f80 if you guys are picking up an f80 and you guys had to choose an individual color would you choose the atlantis blue there's actually a lot of individual colors when i did more research upon it and uh, i would still over and over and over choose the atlantis blue because it's just my favorite favorite color but would you guys choose the atlantis blue or would you guys choose another color well, let me know down below what you guys' favorite bmw color of all time is and if you guys see somebody else that chose the exact same color make sure to thumb it up i'm really curious what you guys think is the best color i want to see that comment on the top without further ado guys i love y'all so much remember to stay humble i see you guys in the next one peace out